Chao. Hey guys, it's Blaine. We're here at Motion Raceworks. It's uh, currently Wednesday. I'll be here the rest of the week and uh, we're going to be moving around in stations and getting after it. So what are you going to teach them, guys? Teach them how to engineer some stuff. We're going to make a part today. That'll be cool. We'll make this guy and then we'll actually program it and go, we'll go out and cut it out. 8.954. Okay, so we have our first dimension. So what we'll do is this is a new, this is a new part file. So we'll go in and we'll start drawing. It's like rectangular, or should we make it? Should we make it come in a little bit? You think? Yeah. Should we maybe make like a make like a make it go out a little bit in the middle? Or? Yeah, we might have to make it go out more around. So this just not that. Yep. So then that mounts right to that. So it's already going to be a roll, basically a roll bar now. Uh, ECU plate. And then like you said, we'll have to add in those spacers and we'll have to figure out the right bolt lengths and all that stuff. Hey Mitch, you want to be the lucky guy that programs something for us for the plasma? Sure. Alright, so Blaine and I just made a mount 10 over 30. Yep. 30? Okay. Looking pretty good, Blaine. We measured it up, drew it up, cut it. Yeah. Looking for the boss's approval. That's pretty sick. That's pretty sick. That's pretty cool. Mission accomplished. Mission accomplished. Sorry, I got four more things for you. Now, once it's the market, you'll know you did it. That's cool. Nice work, dude. Thanks. Good to meet you, Blaine. This is how we make our valve covers, is we have like these specialized pallets that we make. Any of like our high volume parts that we make a bunch of, we make like a special fixture, so that way we can run them faster. Okay. Lucas is getting ready to machine the actual fixture base, and so you'll probably get to catch some of that after lunch, it sounds like. Right. Part of that process is me setting up the TNC coating and all that. Here it just looks like a valve cover to us, but when that goes in, it's a block. Yeah, it's just a bare block. So you have to kind of visualize in your head, okay, how am I gonna take that bare block and create a valve cover out of it? I'll show you like some of the other ones that we have. All right, what are you gonna show them, Lucas? All right, I'm gonna show them how to make a pallet, motion style one.
done it before, Chad? Uh huh, a couple times. Okay, good job. So this could be used for however many tools there in there. Her? Oh, she was tight. She was tight. <laughs> Shoe buddy. Finish her Thanks, up. Chad, Daddy. Yeah. I mean, is that reasonable expectation? We hundred percent reasonable. We could go get the Regal, or we could just start that one. But we're gonna. Make no, we're gonna finish this. We're gonna do this. And we're actually not that far as far as wiring goes. Uh, so we're not gonna be that bad. No. We got like five connections to make, and it, it'll literally be all a current connection. Uh, whether it runs or not, then. That's yeah, whether it runs or not, that's a whole other story. It'll run. We'll figure out. Well, we still need like cam and crank sensors and stuff like that. Do you ever order those, Doug? Um, no, but we can go and get those from the park store. Don't drop that oh. now. Oh, it's falling. I mean, that looked like a close call. That was a big one. Burger and alternator here. Yeah, we're going to have to go shopping in a little bit. Yeah, we're going to We want to make a list? We'll start, we'll start rattling them off, dude. What size do I want to put on this? I think you can only put a 92. 92, that's what the snout thing is. Which those don't even exist yet. They'll be actually here tomorrow. What 92? Test dummy. Chad, what 92? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I don't know what you're talking about. All pressure sensor adapter. Yep, so it bolts right here. Good thing my dad kept the sonar manual from 1976. You'd be lost. I, that way today I could learn how to wire my EFI Nova. It's the same same <laughs> wires we could cut out and which ones we shouldn't. We gotta go shopping for parts. Oh, that's the best, man. We need a whole bunch of parts. Alright, we need to go to Corn Cob. Oh. You know which one Corn Cob is? No. Hey, Corn Cob. What? We need some help. We need some parts. I got a part. Okay, I need an overflow. Cool. Cool. Yeah. Eight, uh, eight to the corner. Eight to the corner. Oh. Eight to the corner is 90. Oh, straight. Straight. Just one. 
believe so. Mm -hmm. Alright, that's next. And we need just normal. Two way. Catch hand. Dual 10. Dual 10? Yeah. Dual 10? Dual 10. Coming up! Oil pressure sensor adapted for drink for uh, valid LS starter, so LS starter. I mean, I got a couple of those. That's the LS. Alright. She ain't gonna run tonight. She might crank. I think that's all we need for race second. car. Alright. Yeah. Well, Thanks, Corcob. You're welcome. I'm here all week. Okay. Well, I'll be here the rest of the week. <laughs> I'll be here. Oh. <laughs> I need some structures around here. Nobody. These unnecessary. Damn, that's a unit, dude. Shoe buddy. Say it. Shoe buddy. Is that what you want? There it is. Is that what it is? That's what I wanted. Okay. Thank you. Okay. Right there. Blaine's here, right? Blaine is actually going to take uh, El Toro on Rocky Mountain Race Week 2.0 with John. I'll be the co pilot. <laughs> you got it. Oh, yeah. And one more time. Can you get full throttle? Oh, yeah. You're good. That's 100%. We can reach the pedals and everything. Put a pillow behind you, you're fine. Yeah. What's going on? Hi. Hey, hey, your dad did that. Yeah. I'm Jeff. I'm his old man. <laughs> I just I mean, we're using these fancy moments. Maybe I should turn it on. Oh, yeah, that might be a good start. Where do you have a little? Well, we're gonna tack these on first. And then we gotta put it in here and make sure everything's balanced. And then, if it is, we'll have wild dust and crack it on. Yeah, what do we gotta do with the fancy Go down and when it's light, it'll go no dark? Yep. Alright. Well, you don't have one of them at home? Why not? I got the old one, so you have to set it and then drop your helmet oh, yeah. and go until you can see the light and make sure you don't. Someday you'll be able to afford a fancy one. Yeah. <laughs> Do a couple more jobs, you know, most of them more yards. <laughs> Well, a couple more cages, probably. Yeah. Probably. Perfect. Good job. That's a lot better than Congo. That's right. You have done this before, haven't you? Yeah. All right, give it a bean. Yeah, I like all this. Coming back. Oh, here's 
take my job someday, aren't you? Yeah. He's taking Doug's job, right? Maybe. 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 Now do you use Facebook? Huh? Now do you use Facebook? Nope. Instagram? Got that? Do you really? Yeah. Clean therapy. Is that what it is? Yeah. Are you going to be a therapist? No. No. His therapy is race cars, right? Yeah. Where's my phone go? He's got a YouTube, too. all kinds of shit on here, don't you? Yeah. Thanks, Herb! Hey, don't sleep on this guy, either. All right. Okay, good job. Are you going, John? Oh, you're working for the girls. Ooh, I love those. Yeah, it didn't leave ourselves a lot of room to get a ratchet in. Thing. No? Oh! Real oh. tight. Real tight real, holes. Real tight up in there. I was hoping... I'd have your little hands at some point, but... We uh, took some video a little earlier and then we went back and edited a little bit of it. Oh, so dang. We're getting some more and then we're going to finish off his video. Are you going to edit your own video? You got a YouTube channel? Yeah. You do? Yeah. Right. He's got Have you made any already? Yeah. You're going to have to teach me some things. I need to make my YouTube videos. All right. <laughs> it can't be dead, can it? It is. Thank you. What do you think, Blaine? Yeah, this ain't grip. Did you want to drive it? Kind of. <laughs> kind of. Yeah, don't be a, don't be a maniac like me until you get. Director. I don't know, I never looked down at the tack. <laughs> Dude, I was just like, when it, we put it in four wheel drive and took yeah. off, I was just looking like, whoa, yeah. we're just hanging it. Wait, okay, maybe I should lift now. <laughs> yeah. You look like you had fun. Yeah, fun. I'm not quite used to it to where I want to slide it around, but flooring it. Yeah. Ooh, shoe yeah. buddy. That was like, hit it. Come on, come on. All right. All right, now I'll go edit some more. Yeah. Let's do this! Get this video done! Blaine's editing his video. Doing a great job, Blaine. I'm Justin, I work here, I'm the manufacturing engineer. So, I also run all the lasers for all of our uh, logos, matching stuff, and parts. A lot of cool, cool, fun stuff. Get out, spend a day or like the next few hours with him. He's gonna show you like the laser and assembly. Right. Show you how to assemble throttle bodies. All right. All right. Here we set the parts in it, push them up into the corner, and once it's filled up, we can hit run. And it's not actually going to go right now, but it'll, yeah. uh, it'll sweep over the parts. And then you end up with nice logos on pieces like that. Hey. Hit this button. Oh, that's 
set on here. So I've got my bin here full of all new blades. Nice. Bin bag. So if you just want to grab a couple of those, you already know how to set them on there. Matter which way? No, not really. Not yet, so right. you're gonna get the male end, which is this one, and you wrap it around the o-ring on the outside, just a little bit, and that's just so the o-ring doesn't break when you put them together. Okay. That's probably good. And then you just gently slide this other end on top of it, gently twist and slide it together, and you'll feel that o-ring. There you go, just like that. There you go. And then you're gonna put one of these bracket bars on top, Two of these through it. Dang, Dang there you go. Ooh. Hold it in the notch. Spin this around and get it to the other side. So once we've got them at this point, we want to use our throttle blade. So I'll take this one up top. You can actually have this one there. Oh, for your car. dude. Yeah. That is sweet. <laughs> I'll put this thing on there. Blaine's 56. Wow, dude. That's sweet. All right. So once you get it in there, you got three bolts to hold it in. So those also need some Loctite. Oh, bro. From this here. You want to say something even more sick? You and your dad are the cover of the first ever Six oh, Magazine, dude. dude. That is sweet. Isn't that freaking dope? How cool is that, dude? They just sent that to me and asked me to show it to you. Dude, that's a legend. Yeah. Mm. You guys are legends now. Wow. Mm. We're gonna have to get that blown up for you. Yeah. Get that in a poster. You probably call your dad and tell yeah. him. You got you want FaceTime? You can show them both, the throttle body yeah. and that. Yeah. Oh, dude. <laughs> Come on. The cover for six of May. Really? The first one. Dude, you guys got the first cover ever. Holy cow, that's pretty cool. Dude, that is so cool. Yeah, and I got a throttle body, dude. Brand new 92. throttle body, huh? Yeah, dude. Check that out. You can't see it, but still. Cool. Well, that's pretty awesome. We'll have a good day, boys. You too, man. Good. Bye. That's it for Blaine's week. Unfortunately, you got to go back to school next week, man. So, but we got you a fresh new backpack. We got you a fresh new throttle body. Uh, dude, it was a blast having some new eyes and fresh blood around. What do you think of the place? This thing's massive. Dude, you gotta cut through this out to hang on your wall. This oh, plasma cutter, dude. Dang, dude. That's a unit. <laughs> That's sick. We'll send you home with all this stuff. Sweet, and uh, if you guys haven't checked out Sick the Magazine yet, um, you saw earlier that they're on the cover. It's like 190 pages for this first issue. Oh. And they're, yeah, I think they're doing four issues a year, built by racers for racers. There's no political BS about who's in there. Yeah. So we're pretty pumped about it. I can't wait to see that article. And uh, Blaine, we gotta get you to your flight, dude. That's it, dude. We're gonna head out, get home, and then we'll be back one day, though, for sure. Full send. Full send.